Hello everyone and welcome back to Altria's Plays, Tron 2.0. I told you we would get back to it, uh, and I finally am. Now, um, I did say... Hmm, I did do a little bit of play, and then I deleted... <laughs> I, I sacked it. I was dying a lot, and I'd forgotten how to play the game. I had to change my controls a little bit, I had to change my mouse a little bit, uh, and I'm just really bad at the game. I also kind of feel like we got further than this already at some point in the past. So... Oh my god. Why? Uh, weird things are happening, and I'm not a fan of it. So here we are. Um, Activating security resin station. I guess I'm just trying to survive now. <laughs> um, it's a particularly difficult part of the, the level, considering we basically this is where we got. These guys are really hard to beat. Um, so, uh, I'm just working my way through this. I expect this is going to take one hell of a long time, as it turns out. Why? <laughs> Why is it so hard to stop that Joker from screwing up my life? You know what? I've activated the data stream out here. I suggest you use it before the crowd figures out. Yes! Let me go down here. Let's just do this. That's way better. Why did we do that in the past? We, there's no energy as well. It was amazing. All I had to do is leg it into him. That's much better. We should do that in the future. Let's uh, save that. <laughs> because I'm not doing that for the 5,000th time. Why is your disc so good? Luckily, I literally just saved it. Just screw this game for it's impossible to beat circumstances. <laughs> Can you switch weapon a little bit faster, please? Let's uh, let's wait for him instead of just going in gung ho, huh? Come on, then. This is a sneaky time for the game. Sneaky, sneaky. Yeah. Sorry, right, they're not people, they're programs, remember this. And that's not an illegal program termination, because I'm allowed to terminate those programs. Even though the system should probably stop me from terminating those programs. Uh, I'm now jam version 4.4. Which is a good number to be. Can you go away? Stop it. You got him. Where are you coming from? I didn't order these jokers. Where? Uh, please let me turn off. <laughs> I happen to remember there's a... There's health here. So. It's not much, but it's something. And we do get a bit back from the core dumps. Once in a while. This has been frustrating. Starts the... Welcome back to Tron. <laughs> the most frustrating game in the world. It's not... As massively and over, over, it's, like, it's not as fast paced as Doom, obviously. Um, but as a result, you sort of expect it to be a little bit more forgiving, especially from its age. People weren't as good at video games back then. Uh, we've completed good news, Mr. Crown from Pop Off, <clears throat> whoever that is. We've completed the first phase of training. Our data rates are adapting well to the environmental simulators. The biological stress appears to be minimal. The real test now is to see how effective they are against various types of security protocol measures. Should be interesting. Um, in case you're, this is unclear. <laughs> in case it's not obvious to you already. Um, oh, I didn't mean to walk off. I uh, didn't need any of that anyway. In case it's not clear to you already, the data wraiths are going to show up soon. We've seen them training from a, a video that we painstakingly went to great efforts to get to. Um, and let's talk to Mathria. Not interested. Uh, they are people who res in in order to fight within the are basically ninjas that get put into the system the same way we did. This is very upsetting. Save this. Oh, I remember this bit. This was a good bit. Probably very hard, but a good bit nevertheless. Right then. Like this. <laughs> it's too quiet. Ooh. Let's um, health up at least. It's gonna be 
way too hard. Let's um, let's use our sequencer. I've got one of those too. I keep pressing E to use things, and it's not the way. It's not the way. Good. Fine. Whatever. Stop messing around with your disc. <laughs> Put that disc. Put your disc away. No one wants to see that. Okay. Okay. Uh. That was reasonably successful and unnervingly so. I feel like these containers are a secret or something, but there doesn't seem to be anything here. Is the area secure yet? Have I secured it? Am I good? Am I the best? Right now. I'll take that. Thank you for the permission. Gives me something to do whilst I'm here. Hurry up. <laughs> do we have any updates yet? So many weirdly violated conventions. And I don't mean that in a rude way, it's just that <clears throat> what we are now used to, like, for example, labels being underneath, uh, being above the thing that they affect, not below them, um, is no longer even remotely the case. Which is strange. What did you just tell me to do? Located? Uh, nothing. What's happening? Try to do a double jump because I think I'm playing Doom and I'm not playing Doom. There's another one over there. Look. Let's grab that. This is weirdly easy compared to the end of the last level. Also, I'm glad that I picked the sequencer. I forgot that it could be this good. Uh, I don't need that. We could take that. We could take that. We can take that. We might need to energy up again, which is going to be a problem. Here's the update you requested from Popoff again. We have trained hundreds of handpicked associates operating under the moniker of data rates. Their objective is to gather information quickly and quietly from inside the digital universe. Most scrap of data will be private from our data rates. Very worrying and very portentous. Pin numbers, passwords, and emails will be at our disposal with this information. Nifcon can exert unprecedented influence on peoples and nations. In fact, we may even go as far as erasing any of those who oppose us. Yeah, <laughs> kind of how it works now. So, well predicted. We have downloaded Unknown Subroutine. It lives in Utility. So, let us learn about it. That will be done <clears throat> in parallel because we're massively good at parallel processing because we're human. What have we got there? don't care if I drain this because it's the whole point of it. There's no point leaving resources behind, I guess, is my point. I'm loving the, the thing in the distance, though. that's cool. Didn't need that. Go up here. Oh, weird physics. We made it. Uh, video archive. We'll have it. Angulate. Okay, I think we already had that. Ooh. Exposition. Looks like the facility's facelift is ahead of schedule. Not quick enough for me. Je detest la color blue. Uh. We must be more diligent. <laughs> the correction algorithms were right under our noses. Mr. Baza, prepare your seeker program. Seeker program. Uh, what's that? <laughs> Excuse me. I was walking. Oh, back in a minute. All right, saved it. I don't need to go up there. I don't need any of that. I'm basically going to save the energy. That was a... <sighs> look. The game allows you to reload at any point, provided you saved, and then redo the fight, which was very easy. Uh, a lot of you, which is probably none of you, were going, "Hey, Burke, didn't you notice, by the way, that your uh, sequencer has a 40% increase in damage, which is presumably on top of." damage that you get from your disc so if you're using your disc instead of your sequencer then you're basically doing a, a energy cost also by the way infinite energy right there which i, I didn't remember from before so um I, I wasn't entirely uncertain about that um so i should have been using my sequencer all this time especially against like at the start of the episode because it was going to do way more damage to those guardian jokers uh, truncate plates let's take that it's uh, corrupted, but I've got a thing in place that hopefully will... It, it, I have the thing, right, that downloads cheap d disinfects? Yeah, it looks like it. So I've got this, which 
is probably more armor than... I mean, that's another 20 more armor than this is 12%, but also I'd have to get rid of something. That's 25%, but what am I going to get rid of, right? What about this? Plus 10%. Actually, I'm guessing between those, 12 plus 25, that uh, plus 10 is only 22, obviously. Um, so let's actually take this out and this. Put this over here and put this in here, which is actually now more armor than I had before. Uh, according to maths. I'm not entirely sure if it's uh, cumulative damage or additive. Sorry, cumulative protection or additive protection, but I think it's probably just straight up additive, so that's probably easy and fine, and we're happy with that. And we will take all this, and then we will save it again, because we will bash our mic. Uh, let's talk to the fluid. Advanced protocols will take some time. In the interim, find the routing modules and rotate it. Yes. Agreed. I will do that. So something here needs to turn. This is going to show up and be a baddie on it. No baddie. Missed the trick there, bro. Go downstairs and there'll be a baddie just straight up waiting for us and we'll have to... You know, shoot it. Forthwith. Oh, that's just a normal, normal guy, but... So here's this joker. Finally, my replacement has arrived. I was supposed I to retire 352 microcycles ago. You look oh, young for your ropes. Yeah, show me the ropes. Do your replacements normally arrive armed to the gills? With all these like attack subroutines. <laughs> Line lenses. Or rotate. This is what rotates the Oculus. Rotating or route powered assistant EN12-82. However, that hasn't been done in a long time. Okay. Cool Oculus. Over here we have the panel that configures the router lenses. There are two ways to align the lenses. Remotely from this panel, or manually using the override bits located in the sublet. Guess what I'm looking for. The lenses must be aligned correctly before power can be rerouted. Well, that's about it. Good luck to you. <laughs> so we probably can't use this because of permissions. Why can't I just press this? Hmm? Well, that's lit. Oh, it's done then. Just have to wait. There we go. And now these two? No? Hmm. Guess I'll go on a mission then. That's what you want from me. Can I turn this off? No. <laughs> of course I can't turn this off. What's the matter with you? I don't have the required permissions. Still don't have the request. Well, this is very rude. I suppose I will be on my way. Let's not have to bother listening to that joker again. We know what we're doing. I'm going to sneeze if that's alright with you. Whether or not that's alright with you. There is a sneeze incumbent. Excuse me. Three, two, one. Where is it? <coughs> oh, pardon. I do beg your pardon. But not enough to have just avoided doing it in the first place. Hey, it's Mercury. Oh, it's just that Cleopatra lady. Hey look, these are very, very lens-like. <laughs> Can't have a notice that there's uh, an unnecessary amount of real-world type yeah. um, sort of, uh, you know, knowledge. Like, this, this doesn't have to look like a lens, this is a computer, it could look like anything. And yet somehow... What does that do? Security resin station. Too much resin. <laughs> Stop security resining me. Nice. Good to have extra discs with extra damage associated with them. You done now? Stop. Cool. Let's, let's uh, optimize. I'm actually very tempted to optimize this new thing here, um, but maybe we want to optimize the lol. 50% faster, more damage. It would give us room for a gold, which would be this. 
Thank you, okay. Uh, hang on. Okay. This would go up to... Oh, it's already at, it's only at 20. I completely misread. Nevertheless, so I, I actually got that wrong. That was my mistake. However, this basically fixes everything for us anyway. So, all's well that ends well. So, uh, I will go quickly go back. I don't want to... We'll do it later. Well, we might not get a chance. <laughs> okay, let's, um, I'm going to nip back and see if we can pick up anything useful out of the uh, things that we couldn't access before. The containers. Hope there's no baddies showing up since we were last here. Doesn't seem so. We now have permission because our enemies just drop permissions. Thanks. <laughs> Carry them instead of just, you know, having them. That makes sense. It's part of the file protocol or something. There's an email. Also, we just upgraded the lol to beta. I'm really tempted to reload and cheese it, but never mind. We completed the modifications to our secret engine per our earlier conversation. You should locate our target in no time. I'll keep you posted. Yeah, I'm a bit sad that I could have just downloaded that, but um, whatever. I've got a goal. Oh, there's an upgrade here. So let's not be too sad. We spent an upgrade unnecessarily, but we did get one free. Uh, and we are better off than we were. It would be min-maxed into the extreme to reload at this point. Uh, we can't put it in, though. We can't can put it in. Um, we don't have anything left that's gold, do we? So. That benefited us nil. Because we didn't have any spaces that were unused. We were well, well optimised for this sector. So, at some point in the future, no doubt we will benefit from this white amp. And of course, it's much better now. So, we're already benefiting it from it simply because it is better. Um, I would like to run faster, though. Fill up our energy. It took a lot of energy to get a YAMP. Um, you know, we, we could have done a lot better. We could have a, a gold triangulate by now or something like that, but he was, like, more armor. Who knows? I do appreciate, by the way, that trying to activate a sec reza that you don't have permission for doesn't just um, <laughs> call the security. <laughs> That's exactly what I would expect to happen. Right, we have to. We don't... Is that in the right place? I'm guessing that's in the right place, right? Hello. What are you doing? But you probably have to press them all anyway because you can't get over there. Mm. What happens if we change it? No. Oh, what? We have to, it, hmm? So that was our... Oh, it has changed. Look, it's all Tetrisy. I don't like this. Save it. <laughs> Very much expecting to be attacked at any moment as well. Don't just jump. <laughs> Have patience. Patience, young Padawan, is a virtue. We, we do have to press this. Because it's going to change the platforms and I'm going to be able to get there. Am I? That doesn't look nice at all. Oh, it's moving. Okay. Well, we'll see. Well, um, you want me to jump from that to that? Is that what you're telling me? Is that what's going to happen here? No? We're okay. We might have to jump from here to there. Uh, what? I can't jump from there to there. Are you talking about? Are you talking about, Willis? Can I? Surely not. Here he goes. <laughs> to jump at all, that would be helpful. Oi vey. Okay. Uh, let's, let's try this again. But maybe if I don't change this one until the way back, uh, maybe. Grab that. I do not think we can jump from there to there at all, which means we are stuck with using this, like this, because I think this will go all the way, so we can actually get over there, which is great. That one needs to be brought downwards. Huh. Still expecting to be ganked by something. Some bad dudes. So this one needs to change. It doesn't need to change it's in the right place. <laughs> it's another one of those situations where I'm just sort of questioning the nature of this place. 
Like, why... Why does it exist? <laughs> what else happens here? What is the purpose of this whole construct? And why can't I just use the buttons upstairs? It's not explained, not adequately explained to me. I want to just use the buttons upstairs, my dudes. So now maybe we can jump back this way. Switch this one back. I'm also, like, I've been in this situation enough times to find baddies up there. I'm constantly on edge. Because there aren't any and there should be. Right. We've moved this one into position again, where it used to be. Reconfigured all the platforms for some silly reason. Oh, great. Look at it now. Hey, you know what we should do when we invent a, an Oculus type system? We should definitely make sure that it's really difficult to move around the, you know, the maintenance level. So that anybody who does have to perform maintenance on this thing is in extreme danger all the time. Rather than just having a, a simple belt and braces protocol for safety harnesses and, and what have you. I'm also expecting those, um, those, you know, flying seeker buggers that keep shooting me. <clears throat> okay, we're nearly there. We nearly made it, baby. 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 I say boys and girls, I think. <laughs> Just needed some reassurance of humanity that there is still good in this world. Right, everything is in position. Can I now get back? After your bizarre adventure with readjusting um, platforms for literally no reason. Hello. That's bizarrely far away. It's very it's very frightening. Uh, well, we can have this. Which is a... Many employees have started to question the whereabouts of Mr. Thorne. His position as security chief carries a rather high profile. We need to address the issue soon. Let's discuss in the next team meeting. Where is Mr. Thorne? Uh, and then number two. Suggest we simply inform Thorne's co-workers that he is out sick with a really bad vibe. I believe Thorne is in the system with me somewhere. Um, I don't have any energy left over here. We could probably cross any of these now, they're all down, right? Yep, that one's gonna gank me. Here he comes. What have you got permission to say? Joe. Where did your... What happened? <laughs> he left a ghost behind. That was scary. That was... That was a... That was an issue. <laughs> that was a bit of a, a, an incident. Yeah, I felt a little bit of a existential quandary going on at, the, at that time. Mm, okay. Let's do this then. Just save it now that we're back. Didn't really give me any um, challenge just now, which is interesting because it was so hard to get out of the previous level. Maybe it's because I discovered the fact that the sequencer is actually decent. Return to the control tower immediately. Nice. The upper deck is being flooded with ICPs. I'm completely vulnerable while docked. Well, we better get up there then. Checked Mafia. You gotta see how. Do you know what? We should uh, pause it here and leave it on a cliffhanger because that's about half an hour. Thank you for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed this episode. Glad to be playing Tron again. Uh, and I hope that you will join me in the next one. And remember, go check out Doom. Everyone's hyped about Doom. Go check out Doom. It's cool. Cool as heck. And uh, Sundays for Stardew streams, which is a little bit less hectic than this nonsense. But until next time, thank you for watching and I will see you.